Hey everybody, hope you all had a great Christmas, holiday season, and new year. As the title of this post says, what do you control? So as we begin, as we begin, excuse me, 2018, oh, I can't believe we're already here, 2018. As we begin 2018, a lot of people have resolutions, and they want to lose weight, and they want to make more money, and they want to... I don't know what they want to do, but they want to do all these new things because it's a new year. Makes sense. So I will ask you this. Rather than make a resolution, how about we create a revolution within ourselves? And I begin by asking you, what is it you control? So here's a simple tip, and here's something that I have people do who work with me. I have them write down a list. Things they control. Things I control. So what do I control? And write them down. Everything under the sun can go on that list. And then right next to it, write down things outside of my control. So we have this list of things we can control and this list of things that are outside of our control. And right there, we get a menu of sorts. And why is that important? Well, it's important because many of us spin out of control because we focus on things that we are not in control of. I'll repeat, many of us spin out of control because we focus on things that we are not in control of. So, quick little story. I used to do yoga. And it was an experiment. I did it for three months. That's all I did. Other than riding my bike, the only training I did was yoga for three months. And what I realized was that in order for me to get better at yoga, this athletic, ex-professional athlete guy, I literally had to let go. I had to let go of the fact that I wasn't good in certain positions. I had to let go of the fact that despite my athleticism, that there were certain things I just may have to wait for, specifically in some of those weird contorted positions. And it wasn't until that I let go of things that I didn't control that I gained control. And I actually slipped into some of those positions much easier. So once you have a list of things you do control, and that list of things you do not control, I will ask you, I urge you, it is highly recommended that you focus on the things that are within your control. And there you have it. Attach that thing within your control to a goal or target you wanna hit this week, this month, this year, this life. You focus on those things and learn to let go of some of the things you don't control, and when I mean some of them, all of them, then things will definitely, definitely improve in your business, sport, and life. With that, stay in touch with me. There is a link in this post, and that is a webinar that I'm doing tomorrow on Saturday with Dr. Clarence M. Lee Jr. It's quite a name, he's quite a guy. So click that link, register for the webinar, 45 minutes, it's free, and we are going to talk all about time, control, and success on that webinar. Hope you enjoyed this little quick one, and as always, I love you guys, and we will talk later. Peace.